I think I'm just gonna keep going painting until I cannot hold my brushes. Shinya works with muted colors, warm and cozy, but his brush strokes are bold. Swipes across the canvas, his works are complex. He calls this piece the mailman because he was intrigued by the way the mailman delivers and receives mail through the neighborhoods. Painting industry with the mix of Bay Area scenery wanted to contrast two elements in one, giving a postcard feeling. And the last piece, he found open light from a cloudy day outside as he sat on a rock capturing a day in a life at Half Moon Bay. But, in his native country, Taiwan, his works was unappreciated. In Taiwan, there's not many art markets. Like, people there, they don't really appreciate arts or paintings. Um, they think those are not valuable. Two million people are full-time artists. It's a very competitive field. Xin Yao being self-employed, does competition come with a struggle? The people here, they, they, they see arts, they see paintings as a treasure. They, they appreciate those art. And that's the biggest difference. In terms of tech, technically, um, there was certain time that I couldn't figure out the way that the direction I want to go or the like skill-wise, I still need to figure it out. Challenges that he had, I don't know that he had any. Because every challenge he had, he worked so hard at that he immediately came over. Xin Yao has turned out to be very successful. What makes him more successful than others? Success is sort of measured on a daily basis mm -hmm. with him. Long-term success, I think he just Take a look at the trajectory where he's on now, extrapolate that out, and I just, you know, I don't think anybody's going to be able to touch him. Before any paintings, I have an intent, like what kind of, like, style or like color scheme I would like to approach. But overall, I, I didn't think that much. I was just like, let, let it go and follow my heart. Xin Yao has integrity, he has a sense of who he is, and he is just working his plan. But he has one reminder. People of the, the, um, the, the basic um, human morality through those ordinary things um, that expresses the, the uh, human relationships between people and the environment. His goal has been fulfilled. But what draws buyers to Xin Yao's pieces? For example, I think art, music, they are related, which means, have you seen someone, you know, sing on a stage? I mean, they can sing, you know, perfectly. Like, I mean, the, the tone, the key, you know, the pitch, everything is perfect, but his voice doesn't really touch your heart. Xin Yao's artwork is like, when I see like, you know, it goes to here. Xin Yao is currently doing business with galleries, who are marketing his great work. It's his urban scenes that are painted in a very um, unique way. If you see the images, uh, there's a, a unique personality that doesn't, you can't compare his work to anybody else. It stands alone. Determination and hard work Xin Yao produced can be summed up in one sentence. I'm talking about the innovation in vision and the innovation in finding a way to make that vision actualized. Excellent comes to mind probably more than anything. Passion, I think.